I see a big problem with my students when it comes to chipping and pitching. They're accelerating their hands and their arms and they're leaving the club head behind. So when I have people use the orange whip wedge, the key is to learn to use your body and let your arms lag. So your arms are gonna lag and when your arms are lagging, the club head starts releasing from your wrist and the shaft unloads at the right time. So when you get here and you have your orange whip wedge, try to turn your body stall on your left foot, rotate fairly level, and when you're turning your body correctly versus standing still and pulling your arms, the, the club will lag in your arms and unload at your wrist. And when your arms lag and your wrist unload, the contact point at the bottom will become way more consistent. So notice the, this, the distance between the weight at the top of the orange whip and my belt buckle stays the same almost the entire swing. So that means I'm not dragging my arms back and I'm not throwing my arms through where this ball gets away from my body. Notice when I make this swing, my arms are very connected to my pivot. My grip stays quiet. When I'm moving my body and my arms lag, the shaft and the club unloads at my wrist. You make solid contact.